Hello everyone, uh, this is part 7 of my Civilization 5 playthrough. Uh, if you want to see the details on how the game is set up, uh, go back and watch the start of part 1. I'll show the uh, mods and uh, the game setup there. Uh, as a warning, like the last part, uh, my allergies are acting up while I film this, though it's slightly better than what I was doing the previous part. So there may be occasional audio dropouts as I'm muting things to avoid having sneezes on the audio track. I will try to keep the sniffling to a minimum, but uh, as anyone who's had to deal with a runny nose or whatever knows, uh, there is not much you can do about it and uh, muting the audio track during that is just not going to be practical. If I did that, then you wouldn't have any commentary whatsoever while you watch yet more of the same. And unfortunately, that is where we're at in the game. The middle game tends to be very repetitive, uh, just like the previous part. And uh, there will probably be a number of parts that uh, look the same as we catch up scientifically and start getting things really rolling along. Anyway, uh, last turn I took out a barbarian up here. Um, uh, so we're at turn 621. So uh, oh, it looks like... Uh, uh, okay, so he's... Uh, uh, cancel his work because of the barbarian here um, yeah, hopefully that horseman doesn't come out and capture him uh, I really should have just back oh there we go see that's the risk you take uh, it doesn't always happen but uh, sometimes it does okay we'll uh, tag the uh, hand axe here uh, we're going to heal anyway this turn because of the promotion we just got. Now, over uh, back over here, uh, before I do anything here, I am going to upgrade to a swordsman. I'll have a better chance at uh, recovering my uh, worker as a result. I'm not overly concerned about having the worker captured. Uh, I will get it back uh, fairly quickly. Uh, okay, so we've got acoustics now. Uh, we're now in the Renaissance era, and now spying has begun. Uh, so I need to uh, uh, move my uh, swordsman up there and take out the bloody hand axe. Uh, unfortunately, this guy is probably going to come out and kill my... Uh, a scout here. Uh, so now we need something to research. Astronomy gives us faster movement embarked. Uh, steel would be useful for the long swordman. Machinery for the ironworks. Uh, chivalry uh, gives us the knight, which is a pretty good mounted unit. Uh, I'm going to go for uh, the chivalry. Uh, what am I building here? Uh, okay, so the Sistine Chapel is up. Uh, so what are we building up here? National Epic. I'll actually uh, put that on hold and build the Sistine Chapel up there. Uh, so I'm going to start building temples, I said. So we'll go in here. We'll change that to the Sistine Chapel. And we'll also go in here and see if... Uh, changing this to production focus speeds that up it does by nine turns so that's worth doing and note that we're still going to grow fairly quickly now we need to figure out who we want to put place our spy with I think I'm gonna go with uh, who with Assyria so because uh, they're my neighbor there uh, what's the uh, Asser, I think, is the uh, capital. 
So we'll move our spy there. Yes, it is the capital. So we'll put them as a diplomat. Uh, the reason I'm putting my uh, spy as a diplomat is uh, later on in the game there's a tech that you uh, you get that uh, increases your uh, World Congress delegates based on the number of diplomats you have out there and it also allows me to uh, uh, have some idea what's potentially going on oh and I got lucky here but I need that scout to heal so I'll just uh, plant him while that happens. And yes, there is land going past there. So, oh, we found the uh, Rock of Gibraltar somehow. Uh, where did we find it? Oh, that's probably, okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, oh, okay, so. Ah, I see. Uh, I got the uh, map revealed around uh, Kaisel, so that uh, uh, that showed me Gibraltar, uh, and that also improved things for uh, Ormus, which is kind of good. Uh, okay, so now I'll start attacking that uh, barbarian there. Uh, let's see. Okay, so I think we're good for now. Oh, I, I must have got gold from uh, my new ally there. Oh, that's cleared the uh, barbarian. Uh, that's got my uh, worker back. Okay, I've built my harbor there. Uh, I think uh, Opera House is uh, a uh, culture building, but I'm going to hold off on building that. Uh, I'm going to actually build... Okay, Gallius, that's the ranged one, right? Yes, I'm going to build a couple of ships to defend my uh, water with. Uh, so that I can reduce the uh, number of losses in my trade routes. Okay, somebody else built Alhambra, so I'm not going to get it. Now that's fine, it's not terribly useful for my play style, so I'm not overly worried about that. Oh, it's policy time. Well, first off, I'm going to irrigate that and uh, build a farm. Uh, I'm going to park this over here now that it's healed. I'll uh, send my uh, units here back there. I really do want this improved so that uh, I end up with uh, more happiness from it. And the policy. So if I take this, then I'll I'll close, I'll finish up pi Piety, and you'll see that gives three culture from Holy Sites, and that's actually good because I've got a couple Holy Sites. So, uh, I'll do that, and it also makes the other buildings uh, cheaper, so there we go. But that does give me a great profit. Um, now, I'm not going to plant all my Holy Sites around my capital, um, let's go and pick some bad land somewhere around a city here. Well, let's say here. We'll plant a holy site there. And again with the uh, friendship offers. Uh, I played a game a while back with 22 civilizations on the huge map. And I tell you, it got really, really tedious uh, refusing friend requests uh, during that uh, whole thing. Uh, let's see here. Uh, oh, it looks like that's just the end of the land there. Uh, okay, what have I got here? 
Uh, I finished building a temple there. Uh, yeah, I think an aqueduct would be a good idea there. Uh, here. Uh, yeah, I think the lighthouse is smart there. Uh, you may notice I often build uh, something that's suggested by the advisors, but I don't always. Okay, we have a great engineer. That's actually good. Uh, oh, yes, this is... Uh, we definitely want to get rid of that bugger. Uh, so another turn, we should be able to put paid to him. Ah, so... Uh... Uh, what does the Sistine Chapel give us? Uh, yes, 25% culture. Uh, that is worth hurrying because I don't want to lose it. Okay, so I'm going to actually fortify my swordsman here, uh, just in case the bloody barbarian shows up again there, and then I'll get back to building a plantation. Okay, so we'll uh, knock that guy off a bit. Ah, okay, here we go. Plant to her profit. You can see the yields improved. And we're getting science from those as well. And that's, uh, uh, I think, is also a Korean uh, advantage. Okay, there's the Sistine Chapel. That's really going to help our culture generation. Uh, okay, and... Uh, well, that didn't quite kill it, but that did. Uh, see, we healed a bit, so that's uh, good. Uh, okay, so... We definitely want to be careful here in case another barbarian spawns there. So I'm probably going to have to let this guy heal after that. Ah, okay, so Sistine Chapel there. We'll go back to the National Epic. Now, the Sistine Chapel has two slots for works of art. Uh, so we'll check on uh, on that. But let's see. Okay, there's the barbarian. So uh, I think we want to clear that guy out, so we don't get more barbarians coming. Um, yeah, we'll let that guy heal. Uh, so the Sistine Chapel has two works of art space, uh, so that gives us a chance for a theming bonus with great works. Uh, I'll uh, check on that in a moment here. Uh, okay, so let's look. Uh, the theming bonus, make sure they're art from the same era and civilization. So uh, we'll need uh, uh, two artists at the same time to uh, make that happen. And we'll be able to do that uh, once we can actually purchase great people. Certainly we'll be able to do it much more easily. Okay, so far so good there. Uh, right. So we'll wander over here and convert that to a farm. All my happy little farms here. Okay. Uh, okay, so that's killed the horseman there. So next turn I'll be able to send my bowmen in there and disperse the camp. Uh, we've got a reasonable amount of production around here. But uh, in this case, uh, well, we've got these uh, uh, plains tiles here. Production from here. But there isn't a large amount.
Okay, as I was saying, there isn't a large number of production-based tiles around here in range of the city. So I'm actually going to put a, a lumber mill on this one. I'm doing that just so we don't short uh, the city too much on production. Oh, somebody else cleared the camp. I wanted the gold, but I won't complain too much about that. I'll put my uh, uh, bowman away here. Okay, we've healed there, so we'll actually work on uh, clearing that. It would be nice if we would actually get the settler uh, when we... Uh... Okay, let's just make sure. Oh, she's not trying to uh, fool us on that. Uh, I've had it happen where they come up with uh, the strength, the steel strengthened our nations, when in fact it wasn't actually an active deal. Uh, but we'll uh, we'll accept that. Uh, it'll keep her happy for a bit. Literally happy, because she'll get the happiness from it. Okay, the golden age is over. Oh well. And we didn't quite take out this spearman here. But I'm pretty sure we'll be able to do it next turn. Ah, we got a promotion. So, well, let's increase our visibility range. Aha, there's more land over there. So we'll uh, clear that camp. Um, this missionary isn't a big worry. So we'll be able to bounce across there. Okay, so... Well, let's build a harbor here. Uh, we really want to get to seaports, which I... Uh, with this mods that I'm using, I believe gives one production to uh, coastal tiles. Uh, okay, that's chivalry. Uh, we'll just make sure this uh, heals. Uh, okay, I got a worker. Uh, but you know what? Uh, I don't have anyone to guard it while I send it to my, uh, my territory, but uh, I'll try anyway. Ah, okay, so banking. I am going for banking. Maybe I'll be able to get the Forbidden Palace. Uh, okay, so I built a university there. Uh, stable would be good, but uh, I'll go with a temple. No, I'll build the stable first. Oh, I found Rome somehow. Uh, that's good. Uh, no, it was up here. Right. Ah, that's where. A Roman settler over there. Uh, okay. Just about healed, so next turn I'll uh, move him. Yeah, we'll do the embassy thing with Rome. Uh, there... Where is his... Uh, oh, there he is. Way up that way. Uh, another great prophet. Uh, next one's at 5,100. So the, they'll come less frequently over time here. Um, let's see... I'm going to stick one over, let's just say here. And then up here, I'll uh, send this guy over here. Just get him onto that land mass. 
uh, which should be part of the main landmass since this is Pangea. Uh, hopefully a uh, barbarian doesn't come along there since there was that camp there for, for quite a while. Okay, so that's, uh, that's that. Um, okay, so I'll go over this way and work on those on the other side of those mountains. Okay, now we're back on land there. We've got some real visibility going. Um, we'll see if we get stymied uh, getting through there. So we haven't found the tundra going north yet. So there has to be some additional space up there. So we'll, uh, we'll head this way and just see what we run into. Ah, what have we built here? The aqueduct. Okay, we'll build. We'll we'll uh, start building amphitheaters. Uh, we'll need those for opera houses anyway. Uh, next uh, policy, I'll start filling out tradition a little bit more. Uh, actually, I might open up patronage uh, for the uh, Forbidden Palace. Uh, I could make, uh, actually, I need production there, so I'm definitely going to put a mine there. Okay, up here. Oh, my. I found the tundra up that way. Uh, right. Okay, I'll plant my uh, profit there. See, I'm spreading out those uh, holy sites so that uh, other cities get the benefit from them. And I don't use up all the resources I have in my capital city uh, without actually getting the benefit of improving them. Okay, I need to re-up that uh, uh, trade route. Notice my uh, trade routes are up by uh, a bit there. Oh, they've cleared that. So I'll get up there and see what's up here. I think I'm going to have to ask for uh, uh, passage through, uh, through Caesar's land. Um, well, I'll uh, propose that. Uh, and he's not going to go for it. Nope. Okay. So I'm going to have to go around the long way. That's no big deal. Uh, hopefully I'll get around there before uh, he uh, uh, fills in his border there. Uh, okay, I see I'm going to run into Japan as well. Uh, so down here, I'll send it that way. Okay, I need to re-up that one. And, uh, okay. So I'm going to get a boat there. Okay, so I've made my lumber mill there. Uh, let's see. You can't improve an oasis, so I'll go over that way. Okay, so there's a gallius. Uh, I'm not likely to see anything come in there, so I'll... Uh, well, first I'm going to bring the boat around, give me some visibility there. Uh, what can I build up here now? I could build an opera house or whatever. I'll build uh, another ship or two uh, just so that I have something I can actually protect my uh, coastline with. Uh, that's something that I've often uh, neglected in previous games is uh, protecting the coast, uh, having boats out. Uh, but uh, 
making sure to get those boats out there it makes a big difference so that's uh, planes so I'm actually going what is this oh that's uh, truffles so I definitely want to camp there uh, so I'm going to uh, put a boat over here I think I really want the boat about here uh, I found a natural wonder Lake Victoria uh, so that's nice Ah, so it's uh, Japan has it okay so I'm gonna have to go around the uh, coast there I see uh, Rome got the uh, a desert folklore one uh, okay into the water there okay what have we built here that was a lighthouse uh, we'll add the university in I'm really trying to get my science rolling along here to get everything caught up on that uh, that'll be really helpful okay so I'll uh, fortify that boat there uh, here let's see what do we get okay we've got a gap here we can get through so that'll be good okay that is uh, uh, quite a big gap that that's actually quite good and you can see the benefit of the increased uh, sight radius here okay so that's got my citrus connected that's good now I can go back to uh, improving those tiles okay there we go uh, more exploration there ah here what I built a workshop there uh, well what do I want here now I'm gonna build the university to re-up my uh, trade route there and uh, that's just plain jungle so that'll turn into a farm uh, okay so far so good again with the friendship thing Okay, oh, I found a city-state. Oh my, an archer. That'll be annoying. Okay. Okay, I finished the National Epic, so I'll build the Musician's Guild as well. Um, okay. So we're up to size 15 on Seoul. So that's, uh, we're starting to get a real city going there. Okay, that takes out that. Okay, so we have a stable there. I'll put the uh, uh, temple in now. Uh, faith generation is up over a hundred now per turn. Uh, that'll be really nice later on uh, when we're actually able to buy uh, uh, great people. Uh, oh, I should uh, improve the uh, sheep there. 
Okay. Oh, barbarians. Barbarians everywhere. Okay, there's banking. That allows us to build the Forbidden Palace. Uh, right. Okay, so we want a pasture there. Uh, we need to re-up our trade route. Okay, so we'll head this way, that way. Uh, I'm going to try and go past the barbarians without having a fight. Okay, now what do we want here? Architecture gives a porcelain tower, uh, which is great scientist points. Uh, the Taj Mahal, which triggers a golden age. Ufizi, which uh, is a free great artist. And Hermitage. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to go for architecture there. And uh, let's see, I have an amphitheater there. Well, I'm going to build the bank. Uh, 25 turns for a policy. A great writer would be nice about now. Uh, we can actually find out the, whoops, that's the wrong one. Uh, find out the great people, uh, great engineers are a long way off. Great merchants, great scientists, great writer is 651 turns. So yeah, we're not going to get one. Um, ow, okay. Uh, let's see here. I suspect I'm not going to uh, get my uh, get the uh, um, forbidden palace, but it would be nice because I'm going to have to open patronage, I believe, to get it. Uh, now it's worth opening that. Don't get me wrong, but uh, I really do want a complete tradition as well. Okay, so let, let's see what's up here. A whole bunch of land up there. Uh, I think there's a good chance I'm going to find a civilization out that way. At the very least, a bunch of city-states. Okay, Kamehameha wants uh, luxury. And he's offering gold. Uh... Truffles, yep, I do have a spare. Yeah, I'll accept that. Oh, I see, I just finished that uh, improvement. Okay, so we'll go over here, build a farm there. Uh, well, there is a city-state up here. Zurich. down just under a hundred faith now that's uh, probably because I lost the alliance with a uh, city-state uh, okay oh look uh, Rome and Japan are having a war okay Oh, the worker made it all the way. Well, I might as well improve that tile. A 
apparently uh, who was it uh, Polynesia was having a war with Japan uh, let's explore some more here oh, I found the Inca well that's good well let's just take a look here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There should be three more civilizations unless somebody's been eliminated. Okay, so I've built a temple there. Uh, we'll build an amphitheater there as well. Again, I'm trying to keep my culture production up. Uh, get it as high as I can. That's why I'm going to build a bunch more cities as well. Although, uh, building a bunch of cities does increase this number. So, okay. There's a boat. Uh, which, uh, I'm going to stash... What? No. Twelve? Well, I'm going to stash it over there anyway. Okay, that's going to be a farm. Ah, okay. So I suspect I'll find other civilizations down, down in here. Okay, I'm ready for a project here. A uh, bank will be a good idea, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll do the embassy thing. Okay, how's our gold uh, coming in? Well, we're getting 22 from the religion now. So that means, what, there's uh, 88 followers. Um, which is uh, pretty substantial. Uh, so we'll just work our way past uh, the Inca here. Oh, there's some barbarians hanging out there with a pikeman. Okay, let's uh, see what our status is. Okay, architecture has some time going on. Oh, uh, Rome has uh, taken a capital. Yeah, we'll put a bank there. Looks like there's a good chance Rome is going to take Japan out of the uh, competition. Okay. Ah, there's the Aztecs. Yeah, that is the Aztecs. Uh, so I was right. I what's that? Terrace farm. Okay. Well, I'll fortify my boat over there. So I need to work my way through there. Uh, I suspect there's a civilization over here. I do wonder though if I'm going to actually uh, uh, find that civilization. I think there is one or two more. 
depends if somebody was taken out by uh, Rome or the Aztecs, who are both uh, fairly warlike. I need to re-up my uh, trade route there. And uh, that one as well. Okay. Oh, well, that's uh, inconvenient. I'll see if there's land over here or if I should go around that way. Uh, no, we're not going to join a war all the way on the other side of the world. But that does remind me, I need to actually start gearing up my military. Um, if I don't, I'm going to get caught flat-footed at some point. Right, I will uh, acquire those horses there. Um, who is that? That's the Inca. You know what? I'm just going to go in the ocean there. Okay, I've got a musician, or a, yeah, musician's guild there. Uh, university or a bank? Amphitheater. That's what I should build there. Let's see if I can get past going around this way. Right, okay. Truffles again there. I should uh, acquire that. Oh, I found some land that's not owned by a city. I think that gets me onto the uh, right land mass now. Okay, so I'll acquire the truffles there. Ah, uh, Greece, so that's one more. Okay, I have a workshop there. Uh, library. I need to get my last library up. I think that's the holdout. Yes, yeah, well fed thing doesn't really amount to a whole hill of beans. Well, there's a city-state. No, we're not going to do the friend thing. Yeah, we'll do that. Where is this? Oh, his capital's way over there. I suspect the last civilization is somewhere in here. Okay, that's a university there. A bank, I think. It looks like my empire is going to go unhappy at some point here. Um... Uh, I'm getting closer to the uh, next social policy. Poland, that's the last one. Uh, is it? 
One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's all of them. I found everybody. I was right. The uh, civilization was over there. See, here is the uh, science thing from Jungles, um, which, uh, you know, it's, it's a great idea to uh, go for it and all, but uh, I find that uh, the other benefits of uh, clearing the jungle tend to outweigh keeping it around. So it looks like uh, three, two or three turns to, uh, okay, this is a hill. I'll uh, mine that. Okay, what have I got here? That was an amphitheater. A bank seems like a good idea. I'm building the banks for uh, gold, you see. A uh, university, I think I need there. That's a science building, so we'll get a science boost as a result of building that in the capital. Who's that? Oh, that's Greece. Okay. That may have been obvious to the viewers, but uh, I should point out that I am partially colorblind. So, okay, no, I don't want to be in a war. So, with that partial colorblindness, uh, I can't necessarily identify a nation border simply by its color. Okay, there's the policy. Uh, yeah, that's not going to work. Okay. Uh, adopting allows... Unlocks building. Yep, yeah, I'll do that. And I'll go back over here. And change to Forbidden Palace. I may not get it, but at least I have a shot at it. Architecture. Now what to research? Um, yeah, astronomy seems like a good idea. Okay, so I'm up around uh, 50 minutes on this part so far. Okay, what have I got here? Well, I'm not going to be building the Taj Mahal there, not with that uh, uh, length of time. Uh, Colosseum, I think, is a good idea there. Um, I'm going to be running into a happiness, is happiness issue real soon now. So I should get the solution to that underway. Right, I need to re-up my uh, trade route there. Uh, send this guy down. 
Right, now, over here, I have a trade route from there. I have room for another one, so I'm going to see, do I have, I don't have the granary in there yet, so I'll do that. Yeah, I'm going to go, go unhappy in a turn here, I think. Okay. I'm just going to work my way west here until I run into the coast. And once I do that... I'm going to work my way across the ocean. Hopefully I'll have astronomy by then and get back home. Okay, so I've uh, got a pasture on my horses there. One, two, yeah, okay. I need to improve that. Okay, so I'll keep on going here. Okay, he's offering me iron and open borders for truffles. No. Somebody else will offer something better. Yes, he did. Yeah. There's a bunch of barbarians there. I think my scout's going to get killed. Okay, that's truffles. Uh, okay, so I'll improve these two t uh, tiles there. I suppose everyone's officially calling them hexes instead of tiles, but you know what? They really are tiles, so... Uh, granary. This is stalled, so... Um, by building a granary, it'll actually grow. I really need to start improving these tiles over here too. So I think I actually need some more workers. Okay, that is planes, so I'll do that. That is grassland. And that's planes. Okay, so, oh, that's uh, also in range. And so is that one. And as I predicted, I have now gone unhappy here. Okay. Oh, there is a city-state. And there's the uh, west coast, I believe. Oh my, it's a great profit. It's a great profit, Charlie Brown. Yeah, I know, that's just a little bit corny. Um, you know what? I'm just going to plant him there where it suggests. And uh, I think that was an incomplete farm, actually.
because it didn't ask me about replacing the existing improvement. So uh, that had to be an in incomplete farm. Okay, I'm just going to take the risk here. In a few turns, I'll be able to strike out due west, and I'll eventually run into my own land over here. Okay, again, I need to re-up the uh, trade route. And no, I am not going to get into a war over there. I don't have anything even remotely close to there. And I don't want anyone sending their units my way. So I'm going to need to start building opera houses to uh, uh, improve the uh, mood of my uh, people here, but uh, I haven't got around to that yet. Other things have seemed more important, because I want to make sure I don't run out of gold when I do that. One unhappiness isn't the end of the world. It does slow city growth. And that's actually not a problem right now, uh, given that uh, it's actually causing problems. Okay, now I can strike out over here. Ah. I want to deal with that barbarian. And what does navigation give me? Seaport. That's actually going to be really useful. But I don't want to get too far behind on these. So I'll go for machinery next. Ah, okay. Market does seem like a good idea, but Colosseum seems more important at the moment. Now having a Colosseum in every city also unlocks a national wonder. Okay, I'll just keep on trucking here. And I'll, ah, there's that uh, that guy dealt with. Uh, okay, need to re up this. Right, okay. It's 30 turns for the Forbidden Palace now. I don't actually think I'm going to get the Forbidden Palace, but it's underway, and if I do, that's two extra delegates at the World Congress. Okay, so I'll keep on going that way. Oh my, I've got choices here. So, heal every turn is actually really useful, but so is Blitz. I'm going to go with the March, heal every turn though because I really need to find that uh, barbarian settlement that has to be around here somewhere. And I probably should have gone this way, but it's not clear what direction the barbarian came from. And this, I believe, is the stitch point between the end of the map. Okay, now there I'll be improving. Ah, there it is. I did go the right way. 
Okay, I've built a bank there. Uh, let's see. That'll take too long. Uh, what is National College Science? No, I really do want to build that in my capital. Uh, garden. Yeah, I'll build a castle there. This is where a land invasion is going to come in, so that seems reasonable. I've built a granary there. Uh, let's see. Right, I need workers. Because I really need to improve, uh, say, a bunch of these planes dials here. Okay, I'm up on an hour here for this part. So a couple more turns. Uh, yeah, once this uh, I get this guy back around to my territory, I'll end the part. Uh, that's uh, I'm gonna make a farm there. Okay, I'll I'll be able to start attacking that guy. That healing every turn thing actually in combat it basically means that. Uh, uh, any damage you take is reversed by the amount you heal each turn so uh, you can you actually uh, get an improved uh, result okay so attack that guy so while I took 28 damage I really only took 18 no I'm not interested in any war Now, did Polynesia actually do the uh, prove the world is round thing? Uh, you don't get any uh, benefit from doing that, but uh, apparently somebody else already did. I didn't notice. Uh, but I have now proven the world is round since I've got all the way back around to my territory. Uh, what here? Um... Uh, let's see, that was a Colosseum, so now I'm actually in the happy again. Uh, circus would be a good idea to add more. And uh, let's just see here, get that uh, scout back on land there. Right, okay. Well, that's improved. Okay, one. One, two, three. Yep, yeah, that's in range, so I'll, I'll do that. Uh, attack that guy. Okay, so uh, on turn 703. Uh, no, I'll go one more. Uh, just collect machinery here and take out that barbarian right okay that's machinery um, right Okay, I'm going to send uh, the scout up this way just to see what's out there. Okay, clear that uh, barbarian. Uh, now I need research. I'm going for printing press. Maybe I'll get the World Congress. Okay, so that's uh, that's turn 704 I'm not quite halfway through the standard game length uh, but I'm gonna call that the end of this part so I'll save my game okay 
So uh, next time around, I expect I'll be doing more of the same. But as you can see, I'm starting to make real progress on the science. Um, so I'm catching up. And uh, I've kept my goal positive, and I haven't been on the wrong side of the happiness uh, tally uh, much. Uh, and my uh, culture is proceeding apace, and I'm generating way more faith than I need right now because great profits keep spawning. But uh, I sus I'm not sure, but I think. Uh, some more uh, interesting things will start happening next turn or next time around. Uh, there's a very good chance, uh, it's almost certain that the World Congress will be uh, f will be founded and that will mean uh, there will be some extra diplomacy and other nonsense going on and, uh, and so hopefully the the game starts to become a little bit more interesting as as the turns progress. Anyway, uh, that's all for this time. Uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.